Hi friends. Today we're going to show you how to make a water bottle bubble blower like Trevor is playing with here. Go ahead and show them how it works, Trev. Um, I can do all kinds of chores, like a ball. <laughs> Those are bubbles he's making. Okay, let me show you what you'll need to make this project. For this project, we used a water bottle, which we cut the bottom off of and discarded the lid. We used a sock. And if you want to cut your sock to make it fit a little better, you can. I just, I have a little sock, so I just threw the whole thing on there. Some Dawn dish soap. You can try other types of soap, but I know Dawn is especially bubbly, so that's what we used. And some water. I have my water here in this dish. We've been experimenting all afternoon with different water and soap levels. So right now I only have a little bit of water and I'm gonna add a little bit of soap. And I'm gonna mix it. I'm just using my finger, but you could also mix with a spoon. We're going to agitate the two liquids so that they mix together. And now we're going to cover the open end of the water bottle with this sock. All right, my water bottle has the sock attachment on the end. We've been using this quite a lot, so you can see mine is already kind of soggy and bubbly. But now we just dip it in the soap and water mixture like this. I'm gonna let some of the excess drip off. And then, Trevor, would you like to do the honors and show everybody what it looks like? Can I do it now? Yep. It's so bubbly. Try and make a really long one, Trev. Whoa. What? <laughs> Now we're adding a little bit of food coloring to our sock and we're going to make some rainbow bubbles. We'll even show you how to make a beautiful art masterpiece with your rainbow bubbles. What? Oopsie daisy. <laughs> I did it on you. That's okay. We got one. Here, let's show everybody how you make, how they come out now. Me? Yeah. Okay. Let's see, can you see the red in there? Oh, I didn't want to show anybody. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Can you stand up and do it? So it goes really long. Oh, I see the colors. Blue, red, green. I don't, I don't. Now I'm going to get a big piece of paper and we'll show you how to turn this into a work of art. Do a couple more. Yeah. <laughs> well, you can see the bubbles. Yeah, you see the bubble marks, right? Do the other one. Try not to touch the paper too much. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Whoa. Check out those bubble marks. Do a couple more with the blue and then we'll try some red. Good job. Yeah, do another one. Like a 
Yeah, go to another part of the paper. Yeah, go to the other corner. Get some red on there. Bubbles off. Yep, you can put that down. Where? Put it on the grass. Yeah. Uh -huh. Now we added some red color to our bubble <laughs> art. Super cool. Guys, when we don't tie with our bubble art, we can hang it up somewhere and get our name on it. Absolutely. Did not the right way. Which way do you want to hold it? That way? There is our finished bubble art. Let's get a close up of all those bubble prints. All the colors came out, all the little bubble it's circles. My hat. It's my hat. Bye, friends. Have fun making your bubbles. Uh, uh, uh.